All right, guys, welcome back. Welcome back to the channel. There we go. Now we've got some proper light there. Um, so we can kind of probably see this a little bit better here. Uh, yeah, guys, so these are pretty rusty. Um, what we're going to do is we remove them. We're really going to cl clean them up. Yeah, there's a lot of rust in there. Um, I don't think I'm going to use a uh, trusty... For this little jobby jobby job here, I think I'm just gonna use a um, just a manually. Uh, I'm gonna apply this sort of steel brush. Yeah. So let's let's without further ado, guys, let's try to get the rest of these off. Um. So the first weak one. The weakest link in the chink um, came out pretty. I think if I get a small, um, if I get like a small flathead or a tool like this, see, these are handmade tools, guys. Um, see, I think what I can then do, see, is like have some leverage here. Um, so, <laughs> nope, not really working that well. Um, I'm breaking my, um, all I'm doing is breaking my nail by sticking my nail in there. Bob, the first nail actually worked, guys. Um, well, there's a broken nail. I'll be everywhere. Um, so let's try to apply <laughs> some pressure. Yeah, see, I was... I was, um, I was pretty sure that was going to happen. So, let's apply some pressure underneath. Nope. It's all about that leverage. Um, see? Maybe if we get in there and clean out some of that gunk, but I don't think so. Hmm. Yeah, so see this bit here. Once it goes back in there, guys. Um, see, that's the bit. So we don't want to um, grip that. Uh, wow, yeah. Um, so perhaps... Yeah, when, when all else fails... Wow, guys, look at that in there. I mean, is that dirty or what? That is some years of, oh wow, look at all that dust. That is very, very many years of no, naughty behavior with my Brompton. T taking it to, to the Amazon jungle. Actually, what I need, guys, here is like a softer bristle brush. Um, maybe something to this effect. Yeah, let's put the, uh, the generator on. Yeah, we 
try it with another one and see what happens. clean it out. one out. What great success. Look at that. But the, the second part. <laughs> the second bit does not want to come out. So. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, look at all that gunk in there, guys. My gut. Mine I got, um, but I will clean you guys up a little bit later. Well, I think at some point, uh, the way these screws and then uh, caps, or I don't know what you want to call them, um, nuts are designed, is that at at certain point after a few revolutions um they just let go uh because as you start getting them off uh just got gets easier and easier and easier with each revolution um so i don't know what kind of screws what you call those screws guys um but that's basically it um there's our main one it looks like it still has some anti anti seize uh, anti seize oil in there. All right, guys. So yeah, we've survived screw two. Um, I'm gonna continue doing that. Probably show you guys um, show you guys how how the rest of them quickly come out all right in the next uh in the next in the next super segment guys all right so thanks for tuning in again please like subscribe and share it really helps my channel grow hasta la ciao ciao bye for now over and out from the concrete jungle of chicago